Hello, this is Dr. J back with some more Let's Play Fire Emblem Engage. We're finally going on to Chapter 15, The Northern Fortress. My cat is still rumpusing around, so we'll see if she, uh... She causes any issues. Alright, we're jumping straight in this time. The Ring of the Crux of Fate. So that's gonna be, I'm guessing, the player avatar from uh, Fire Emblem Fates. Don't know if it's gonna be the male or female version. We'll find out. <sighs> My new moves are coming together nicely. Just a bit more practice and I'll call it a day. And this spot, it's perfect for rehearsal. So quiet and empty. <gasps> what is that? <gasps> no good. I'm trapped here. Is it my fate to die like this? It's such a pity. To be caught so unprepared, I'd have practiced combat as well as dance. Hurry! You must get to safety now! Who said that? Oh, thank goodness. You can hear what I'm saying, can't you? Follow the sound of my voice. You can hide in here. There's a door to your right. Now go! Hurry! I'm coming. <laughs> Oh boy, we're in slapstick mode. So, my first dancer. Is the Northern Fortress that frightening? Looks like my first dancer is going to be that dude. Not gonna lie, I, you know, I kind of prefer it when my dancers are, are cute females, but... You know, it's good to have someone in your party who can get your uh, party members to take two turns. It's useful. Yep, my ancestors designed it that way didn't want people to go poking around the locals won't get near the place they say ghosts wander the ruins you know on that note how come you're not a dancer to marry your character design is basically perfect for it a haunted castle lately some have heard a young woman's voice calling out from inside <sighs> relax that's just the local lore then why did you make it sound so real sorry sorry I shouldn't be talking. I've never even been there. Mom always told me to stay away so nobody would figure out the ring's location. There it is now. The Northern Fortress. Hmm. For an abandoned fortress, it's awfully noisy. Wait a sec. The Corrupted! They've gotten in! Let's go. We can't let them get the ring. Oh no. Yeah, this place is swarming. Guess it is a little haunted, huh? Well, it is now. Hang on. Divine one, look! There's someone here. They have us well and truly surrounded. Again. Still, safer inside than out in the open. Yeah, I'm afraid this guy might end up being our dancer. Thank you, Ring. I was telling you to hide, not come looking for me. How could I stay away? A talking ring. You really set off those creatures as well. I take it you're a princess, trapped in this unusual form by a wicked curse. Let me help. Actually, I'm... No need to persuade me, your highness. I'm not one to doubt an unusual story. Oh, spirit of the cards, cast your light upon the path before us. You're a fortune teller, hmm? What are your cards saying to you? Le Dragon. It means help may come from an unexpected source. I suppose we'll just have to hold off the beast until it arrives. Okay. Tiny map, it seems. Oh, no, never mind. Do we have Fog of War going on? What's happening here? No, it's not Fog of War. It's just that the map is going to become revealed piece by piece, it looks like. What's our victory condition? Sea doll escapes. To where? To here. Okay. Okay, these walls are destructible, so it doesn't look like it should take us too long to get to him. 
doors everywhere. I'll bet there's chests and stuff in these. Which means it would behoove me to explore this place. Rather than just going straight for the victory condition. Okay, so dancers are martial artists in this, uh, this Fire Emblem game. In some past Fire Emblem games, dancers literally just dance and don't do much else. But not this one, it seems. Alright, so we've got Lancers, Axe Users. I'm seeing a lot of Axe Users. Okay, and a couple of Lancers. So, Axes of my own will be good, because they'll trade even with the Axes and they'll have type advantage on the Lancers. So, you're coming along again, Lapis. I feel like flyers won't be as useful inside. I might bring them along anyway. Hmm. My team composition looks pretty good as it is. Oh yeah, I need to reassign Diamant to Ike. Ike. Leave it to me. Wait, how come... Oh, right, Byleth would have gotten unassigned after I did his trial, and I never reassigned him to Vander. Lord Byleth, let's go. All right, well, I tell you what. I'm going to leave Chloe behind this time. Maybe I'll take Vander. And what other swap should I do? Hmm. Gosh, the number of guys I can bring is so limited. Uh... Maybe I'll swap Marin for Diamant this time. Okay, uh, I think this'll do. Let's go. That guy's not here to steal the ring. I think he's trying to protect it. He's clearly no friend of the corrupted. Let's give him a hand. It looks like he could use one. Well, at a glance, this looks incredibly easy. Kill a few corrupted, break through the wall, and he's out. But like I said, it seems like it'll be to my advantage to explore this place more thoroughly. So, we're gonna give that a try. Alright, since that guy's a Lancer, you should have type advantage on him. Used a Silver Axe. Of course, he'd hit back and do 24 damage, so that's not ideal. Oh, Vander. Everybody doubles you, and it's just kind of sad. Whatever you need. Use your Hand Axe, then, I suppose. Honestly, maybe preemptively engage. Emblem engage! Ugh, the damage is so poor. I'm in. Anytime. Pull out your axe. Here goes. If I engage, I'd be able to attack right away, so that could be useful. Why not? Why not? Em 
Problem engage. Actually, even better option. Let's engage and call our doubles. I'm really starting to appreciate that ability. I'm understanding how to use it. Ready. Run into the middle of a pile of enemies, call your doubles, and let your doubles tank for you. And then if enough of them survive, they can really contribute to your damage when you counterattack with them. Understood. Let's go. Yeah, sure. You'd have type advantage on that guy, so I need to remember he can use axes as well, Diamant. My will is I have plenty of axe users available at this point between Diamant and Lapis and Vander, although Vander's still questionable in terms of his actual effectiveness. <laughs> Oh, that guy with the compact axe doubled him. Honestly, the doubles are crazily strong, now that I understand how to make best use of them. Go ahead and weaken him up. There, Yunaka. And Vander, take the kill. Let adjacent allies act again. Well, I only have one adjacent ally, so that's not so great under the circumstances. Ooh. A reed bar. Interesting. 96% hit chance. 100%. That's what we want. Let's do this. I am most grateful. But it's speed that you really need. What is pivot? Is that when you start lowering interest rates? Use to move to the opposite side of an adjacent ally. Well, that could be pretty useful. Alright, yeah, wreck his face. Not much of a level. I could Astra Storm to help out uh, C. What was his name? C. Dill? C. Doll up there. Not that he seems like he really needs to help, but. Better safe no, than I sorry. Survive with 2 HP, huh? Not if I used a killer axe, though. Here we go! 
And get wrecked. Remember this. All right, well, let's start busting through the wall. It is destructible, is it not? There we go. Yeah. I was just being silly. Oh, we, we didn't even need to destroy it. We can get through some already existing gaps. So, by the way, what's all this ominous pink energy? Floor plus miasma. Okay, makes us a lot weaker and foes a lot stronger. That's no bueno. Alright. I don't need the kill, so I won't take it. Hortensia can take the kill. Alright, I'm the one who can talk to this guy. Don't think anybody else can from the looks of things. But uh, let's start busting down these doors. Louie, indestructible Louie, you can lead the charge. And together with my dodge tank, two of my tankier characters for very different reasons. Oh wow, lots of miasma and enemies. Not seeing any uh, treasure, but maybe there's some deeper inside. And either way, there's a lot of XP to farm. And that's what really matters. All right, well, let's recruit uh, Seedall here. Hey, buddy. You there. Are you hurt? Who are you? Don't worry, I'm not your enemy. I'm the Divine Dragon. The Divine Dragon, you say? What do you know? My card spoke true. Unexpected source indeed. Thank you. I am Seedall, a traveling dancer. I was out there rehearsing. Those creatures appeared. A talking ring called me to safety. A talking ring, hmm? Yes. I believe it's a young princess who fell victim to some sort of curse. Isn't that awful? Not a curse, exactly. You know her story, then? Tell me, who is this mysterious ring woman? Hand it to me, and we'll find out together. All right. Bear your fangs, emblem of fates! I thought it was weird how the player avatar in Fates is barefoot. Corrin. I'll fight with all I have. That's right, Corrin was the canonical name for the player avatar in Fates. Yeah, I always... Like, why barefoot? I don't know. That that aspect of that character design always struck me as weird. Thank you for finding me. 
I'll help ensure the path you decide to walk is the right one. Thank you, Emblem Corin. I'm sorry I kept you waiting for so long. An emblem? Really? One of the godlike figures of legend. Seedal, would you fight by Corin's side? We could use your help getting out of here. It would be my pleasure. This world, wonders upon wonders. Ah. Huh? Did those doors just... I was wondering if the game was going to do something to prevent me from just backtracking. Because it seemed like 75% of the map was optional. And that would have been weird. But now it begins to make sense. We won't be able to escape the way we came in. Let's try that path over there. I'm betting if I hadn't already destroyed this door, it would have selected that one. So that's some good scripting to account for the fact that I might have already destroyed the door. Alright, we do not want to fight in that. No way. Mm, the enemies can fight us from there and still get bonuses, so that's a problem. But it's a problem that's going to be hard to do anything about. Could just... Divine One, as a dancer, I can raise your allies' spirits with my graceful movements. Please, call upon my abilities as you see fit. Will do, will do. Yep. Yep. Okay, uh, so if I park here, well, he could still just... No, never mind, he doesn't have enough movement. He couldn't get behind me. And does he have a ranged weapon? Not that I see. So, if I just park here, he won't be able to get it, the advantage of the miasma. I can start tossing my javelin at him. Now, he will have type advantage on Louie. Lance, Lance, Thunder. All right, go here, if you please. Well, hold on. Okay, that guy doesn't have enough movement to get up behind her. All right, so go here, Fram. The Miasma makes this interesting. I really have to think hard about the terrain and my positioning with all the Miasma around, so that's cool. All right, well... Yeah, I noticed. I was in such a rush earlier. I didn't notice the miasma all over the place. Uh, that's quite the rush. It's pretty obvious. The creatures must have brought it with them. It certainly wasn't here before. Use my power to dispel the miasma and open a path for your allies. Oh. Okay. Didn't realize that I could do this. Interesting. Looks like another AoE attack. Wow. You have very interesting abilities, Corrin. Okay. Well. Uh, let's see. So, go ahead and engage. Emblem, engage! And okay, I guess I didn't need to engage to use that though, did I? The stage is mine. So let's not waste it. Alright, go ahead and clear this miasma if you please. Okay, but now I've kind of blocked the way with ice pillars. <laughs> uh alright, well, let's start destroying them. At least they only have one HP, so they're not hard to destroy.
put up a good fight. Ah. Should have accounted for the fact that he can attack from there. Not that it matters, it only increases their defense, not their attack. Good work, Fram. Oh, what the heck was that? What's that curious dance? At start of turn, allies within two spaces of unit recover 10% of their max hit points. You mean you have a regen aura? Wow, that's a really good ability. Holy crap. Dragon. As much as I wish Seedal was a sexy dancer girl instead of, well, a dude, his uh, his dancing abilities seem really useful. I cannot believe he's a passive AoE regen hub. That's kind of incredible. Alright, well let's see. I bet you can tear that guy apart, Saline. Oh, Leaven Sword doesn't do as much damage as I thought. Oh, wow. Oh, it's because he's in that stupid miasma. Can you do something about this, Seedal? Nah, it doesn't affect occupied spaces. That's very irritating. Wow, that defense effect is hardcore. This guy's too hard to kill while he's in that space, so let's just leave him alone. He'll have to chase us, and we'll take care of him. Alright, fire will take this guy out. Might take some retaliation damage, but... All flowers eventually wilt. Start breaking down the door, perhaps. Oh, nope, never mind. We're not in front of it, so that's not going to work. Alright, just chill out there for now then, I guess. Alright, well, go ahead and dance for Fram. I feel great! That doesn't seem favorable. Wow. Zero damage. And that's with type advantage on that guy. That miasma is a serious problem. Or miasma. However the heck you say that word. Maybe start busting down the door. We're like a true adventuring party. We don't even bother trying to open doors. We just bust them all down. I don't want to destroy it yet. I want to kill this guy first. We're going to have to lure him away from that miasma. Handle with care. Does he have thunder? He sure does. I should probably keep Louie well away from him, if at all possible. Wow, that's annoying. Ugh. Wow, this guy is indestructible while he's in that stuff. You know, I think maybe I should have just busted down the door after all. Finish it off if you please, Fram. 
We'll just force this punk to follow us. Once he's out of that, we'll kill him real hard. Alright, do not engage the enemies in the miasma. Force these guys to come to us. See if I can lure that axe user. Ah, I can't quite get in his reach. Alright, that's not going to work. Your orders, please. Ugh. There's nothing I can do about it. He's just... Ah, I forgot to give him his vulnerary. Um... Can you access the convoy if you're next to me? You sure can. There. Grab a vulnerary. Use it. Hopefully he won't get killed. Since Miasma doesn't increase attack power, I don't think he will, but he's going to be very vulnerable to magic attacks. Okay, that wasn't so bad. And he's out of the Miasma, so now I can go kill him. Okay, so the ice automatically gets destroyed after a turn. Good to know. Hmm, you wouldn't quite kill him, unless you used a Silver Lance. Take him down. Not so do not so tough out of the Miasma, are ya? Was that sufficient? It was sufficient. Sufficient level up, too. Yeah, I'm remembering this effect from Fates, where there were terrain tiles that you could interact with. Dragon Vein, yeah, that's what they were called. And they could cause some pretty interesting effects. So it's neat that Corin has a, uh, you know, a related ability. I like that. That's pretty neat. Alright, we've got an Axe user there. Let's charge and take him down. Alright, let's park somebody next to Hortensia. Mm, Diamant can't quite get that far, though. Looks like nobody can. Alright, fine. Just take him out without any support increases then. Oh, critical. Totally unnecessary critical, but good job. Now, I have kind of made a target out of her, but... Oh no, they actually can't reach her. She's fine. Never mind, then. And here we've got an axe user and a mage. Diamant will be able to take care of the axe user quite handily. Could send Fram in to deal with the mage. You always get these bottlenecks when you're fighting in narrow corridors like this. And the ice breaks now? Yep. Cool, cool. Alright, let's take these guys down. Oops, not engage, just attack. Survives with 2 HP, that always drives me nuts. Looks like there's nothing for it though. Remember 
Take him down, Fram. It's decided. Also, I just realized that guy didn't survive with 2 HP after all. Maybe it was the other guy who would survive with 2 HP. I don't even know. I'm already forgetting what the heck was going on. Anyway, okay, so we've got a couple of L Surge users. Why is the fact that they're level 20 shown in green? Does that mean it's max? Who knows? Who knows? Would you get wrecked by these guys, Vander? No, you'd kill him. With an 89% chance, and if you fail, you're going to get really wrecked. I'll try it. All right, good. This is the mission of the stewards. I love my increased speed. I'm really glad I gave it to my my player avatar. This increased mobility is it's just incredibly useful. So I think that was definitely the right call cuz I'm the one who I want darting all over the battlefield anyway. A sword, two sword users. All right, go ahead and dance for Saline. What good fortune! Ah, survives with one HP. It drives me nuts. Oh well. Huh. All right, Whatever poor you require. poor Louis. He's slow to begin with. He's never gonna catch up. She's standing in a miasma space, too, isn't she, for lower defense? Yep. Okay, good. The other guy can't reach her. Whew. All right. All right, Hortensia, take this guy out. Okay, you can't, but you can weaken him. Maybe have Vander take the kill. 37% hit chance. Well, he does have type disadvantage. What about the Iron Axe? 47%? Guess you're not taking that kill after all, Vander. Alright, you knock a will then. He survives with 2 HP. Okay, very annoying. Why can nobody kill this guy? Lapis? Please? Good, somebody has the ability. I'm in. I won't let this go to my head. I guess he was standing in an increased defense space. Wow, avoid plus thirty with those pillars, no wonder. That explains much. Ram, can you get close enough to heal Saline? Well if I pull Saline back a bit, you will. All right, bust down the door for us, Vander. Aha! Finally, a treasure chest. And a couple of axe fighters. Now I can just park myself here and take care of that. Yeah, I... well, let's see.
Could also dance for Hortensia so she can get another turn. Wow, max hit point plus seven? That's a pretty darn good bond effect. Wow. All right, I can get in there and start killing them, but that guy's standing in Miasma, so not, not good. Let's let them come to us. And Hortensia... I don't think they'd one-shot her. And she can also get a preemptive strike. Let's just make sure they don't have ranged attacks. Steel Axe, Steel Axe, and that's it. Okay, that's fine then. If I can, I shall. Alright, well, just move to there and I'm gonna heal you up. What a joyous feeling! Louis very slowly makes his way to join the team. Alright, Yunaka, join us down here. level. Oops, not engage. Not engage. Make that mistake all the time. 1% hit chance, I'll risk it. Was that too much? Yunaka's fights are seriously cool looking. Hortensia, open this chest for me. Energy drop. That's plus strength. That's incredible. Yeah, that's really, really good. Alright, well, let's bust the next door down. Also, I could go here and regain my Emblem Energy. That's probably not a bad idea. Oh, that is a lot of Miasma. Oh, boy. I think I'm going to want to park Seed All here and get rid of all this crap. Okay. That's not in range of any enemies, so... Yeah, I can't quite get all of it yet. Let's just wait till next turn. And... Alright, I'm gonna send Vander over to get that Emblem Energy. Yes. Start making your way up here. Maybe I should go for that emblem energy, actually, and then maybe Vander could take... Ah, this room's full of it. It doesn't really matter. All right, Vander, go ahead and recharge here. All right, Seed all take care of this miasma for us. It's in the way, and it's pretty annoying. Oh, 
Wow, Louie's actually going to catch up to us after all. Good, good. Maybe take out this Miasma next. Or I might want him to dance so that somebody can go twice. Alright, we've got Lance users. Which means I want my Axe fighters to get in there. That would be Lapis to fight this guy. And I can park myself here. Get some support. And also the... Uh, the buffs that people get by standing next to me. Beautiful. Who's next? Could just send Diamant in to get the kill. Might not be a bad idea to use Vander. Uh, so many options. Alright, let's use Diamant. That guy does have a Lance, so I do have type disadvantage. So I should maybe use the Axe instead. Except then he hits me first. But then I break him. Hmm... Whatever, it's just 7 damage, and Diamant is very strong. And you only get broken if the enemy attacks you with type disadvantage. You don't get broken if you're the one who initiates the attack. Oh wow, I forgot you have a regen effect when you damage things, so you didn't even take any damage effectively. Okay, so yeah, that went extremely favorably. Alright, get rid of this Miasma. Don't even want an opportunity for them to stand in it and get the huge defense bonus. Because that defense bonus they get from it is no joke. Should I weaken him up? Why not? Look at that! One more damage, and he would have just been dead. So close. Unnecessary, but... Ah, jeez. Vander can't get anywhere. People standing in the way. Good dodge, good dodge. And another guy reduced to one hit point. Alrighty. Let's see. Planning out my moves. Okay, I think I know what I'm going to do. I am not worried about two points of damage now. I will park myself here. Okay. Can get some support with Hortensia, who can also take a kill. Let's do this! Allow me! Thanks for looking out! And then some support with Lapis, who can also take a kill. Let 
Oh, terrible level. And then maybe another kill for Vander. And some support with him. 99% can I do better? 100% is better than 99. Here we go! For the Divine Dragon. Next turn, I'm going to want to remember to get some energy. Or I can do it this turn. Alright, well, dance for me, seed all. I feel a little dirty saying that. Thank you. There we go. Oh, my cat's back. Again. You want fed? I'll feed you soon, girl. Hasn't been that long since your breakfast anyways. I won't flinch. I do not want to bust this door down while standing in miasma. That's for sure. So Seed all, if you please, take care of this miasma for us. Let's break these down preemptively. Whoa, cat. No, don't. 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 Uh, she's being a pain. Let's bust down the door. Yet more miasma. Okay, we're almost out. This is the last room. This room is filled with miasma. Good lord. We're gonna want uh, Seed All to come forward and help us out again. Where are we gonna want to send into the room? Don't know if that's. That's a little closer. Okay, we can go just inside the door, and it's not within the enemy's range. Understood. Oh, I'm silly. I need Seed All to be able to stand there. Okay, well, whatever. Just switch places with uh, Vander. Stores five hit points to adjacent allies and sli slightly increases support with them for just standing there. Huh, Corrin has some interesting effects, apparently. And let's just wait for the ice to be destroyed. Good. Maybe go to here. Take care of this miasma. Alright, and now let's kill this guy. He's got a hammer, so swords will be effective. Wow, even with my uh, increased speed, I can't quite get there. Hmm, I didn't plan this out great. How can you do here, Vander? Not bad. Go ahead and engage. Lend me your strength. Ah, we could use Ari Bar, which doesn't really do better. In fact, since it's a lance, we'd have type disadvantage, if anything. Let's just use the silver axe. I can engage and get insane range, since Lin is the long-range artillery.
Lend me your strength. I could also call a bazillion doubles, but I don't think I want to do that just yet. Let's just kill this guy. Dream well. Let's just have everybody engaged. This is the Stand down or perish. This is the final room, so there's no reason to hold back. I can pull some enemies and use great aether. Ooh, oh, I just realized there's a spot of miasma. That's no bueno. Can I park anybody there? Oh, he's going to park himself right there and become really hard to kill. Dang it. Quick I didn't plan that out so well. Uh, I'm trying. There's just so much freaking miasma in this space. But at least I can use bonded shield, which should help. Do not attack that guy while he's in there. Will be fairly futile, I think. Oh, he didn't even stand in the miasma. What an idiot. Ah, you got doubled again, Vander. Man, he needs speed so badly. Oh, is this the enemy boss? Suddenly there's boss music. Ah, that guy's in. Oh, we're about to lose Vander. Oh, nice dodge! Aww. Unacceptable. There's just miasma freaking everywhere. I am but a hindrance to the divine dragon in this shape. For now, I must fall back. This room is a pain. Well, he didn't kill anybody, but he did some good damage. Yeah, man, their defense is high in that. How about if I just Astra Storm that punk? God, they're so strong in the miasma. As if I lose. This is it. I mean, Astra Storm typically one shots people, but it didn't even get that guy below half health. It's crazy. I know I don't need to kill that guy to win. I just need to get seed all to these spaces, which I can literally do any time. But obviously I want this treasure chest, so... Ninety-eight percent hit chance, but we can do better. Like a hundred percent. 
Oh wait, that guy's got a revival gem. My apologies. I just now noticed that. There's nothing special about him design-wise that distinguishes him that much from the other corrupted, so I didn't didn't realize he's quite such a boss enemy. I'm ready. Alright, well. I don't think he'll stand up too well to uh Diamant. Sadly, Lapis has no ranged attacks. I ought to give her, like, a hand axe or something. Parthia would hurt this guy a bit. Fram can't get in there. Good grief. Um, could have Seedall give Yunaka another turn. Let's try that. Go ahead and engage. Join me for one song. Can't quite finish him. My god, the miasma is a pain to deal with. I mean, this guy is taking so many more hits than he ordinarily would. You wouldn't think that defense plus 20% would be that big a deal. But the way the math works in this game, or not plus 20%, plus 20, never mind. It's not percent, it's an absolute number. That's why it's so ridiculous. Plus 20 is... Freaking huge. Make no mistake, that is a gigantic increase. Alright, and you two will... He must have a range attack. Yeah, the Tomahawk. Oh good, he came out of the miasma, what an idiot. Seriously, what a moron. I don't need the kill. I don't even particularly want the kill. Give it to you, Naka. Well, that was quite the evil laugh. Wow. Alright, who gets the kill on this guy? Maybe Fram. Don't want to neglect Fram's levels. Not a great level by any means. All right, let's get the chest, which means I think giving Yunaka another turn. Big help. Ah, god damn it! That doesn't even work. Whatever. We'll just grab it next turn. There's no enemies left, so despite the dramatic music, we, we are done, basically. Alright, whatever's in here better be good. A talisman? Ugh. I mean, it is a permanent stat upgrade, so it's not like it's awful.
still. That felt like an awful lot of trouble just to get a talisman. And we win. Right? Our paths diverge for a moment. Divine one. Emblem Corin. Thank you. I just had to confirm it. Wow, well, it was quite a level. It was really fun. The Miasma plus the Dragon Vein effect created some interesting tactical decision making and the cramped quarters, the hallways that then open up into rooms and such, also really make you think about your positioning and just sort of progressing through that sort of dungeon environment. Yeah, that was that was a fun level. I liked that one. It was a long one, too. All right, well, that's it for another episode. Next time we see the aftermath, probably going to do a lot more logistics-y stuff on the Somniel, if I were to guess, before we proceed onward with the story. So hopefully you'll join me for that, and I will see you then.